A father tonight is fighting for his life after he contracted a flesh-eating bacteria while crabbing in New Jersey. His family is optimistic, but they also want to warn others about the danger. Delina Perez Delon says her father, Angel Perez, is an avid crabber. He likes that catch. On July 2nd, he was crabbing at Matt's Landing in Maurice River. But hours later, his right leg began to swell. It turned practically like brown, blackish color. It was swelling, it was blisters. Photos taken by the family showed the discoloration and the swelling. The infection quickly spread to all four limbs. Perez is now in the ICU at Cooper University Hospital. Delena says doctors blame a bacteria called Vibrio. It's part of a group commonly known as flesh-eating bacteria. Vibrio is found in brackish water and seawater, especially during the hot summer months. The family is now warning others to be careful. Be careful. Um, the water, as much as we need water, it, it can be poisonous, it can be dangerous, and we don't know what we're getting into when we get in there, and that's why they do use boots. People use boots and coverings to protect themselves. Perez has Parkinson's disease, so he is at greater risk for problems. But the New Jersey Health Department says if anyone has open cuts or scrapes, it's best to stay out of salty water. Anyone with liver disease or a weakened immune system should also avoid eating raw shellfish because the bacteria can also be spread through food. So frightening. This infection, it is rare. But New Jersey does see several cases each year. As for the family, boy, they're just taking it day by day, but they say the father is in good spirits.